welcome back in this video we'll see exam module so let's try to enter result let's select exam type is annual how do we create this exam type go to result setup and you can see exam type button here you can create or rename any of the existing and existing exam type so this is in exam type annual I We'll try to rename it to final and just save and you can see this is final now same way you can create a new one um, let's say pt1 and save and you can create a new one so let's select final class first a subject mathematics now these have already been assigned and you can see that class has following subjects assigned to it the subjects assignment happens through here um, click on the class and section and here subjects and here you can create a new subject to add subject and assign class to it so you can create a new subject let's say social sociology co and you can assign as many classes as you want okay this is a um, let's assign okay and save it so you can see this new subject has been created and if you want to assign more classes you can assign it from here like that so let's go back to result entry and once again final select class first a subject mathematics order by a name so that alphabetical order names appear select max marks 100 this max mark setup I will show you in a while take some date and as soon as you enter the date it appears here you can change the date for an individual student also um, then let's enter 99 marks and as soon as you enter 99 and press tab you can see grade and result automatically calculate this happened because we have already done some setup but I'll show you before that let's save this okay this is saved and go back now let's just refresh the page and you can see this is already created and if you go to edit in this you will see the marks that we entered okay so let's just click again here and if it is something if there is something wrong you can just delete it and you can delete the record I won't delete it right now but you can use the delete button to delete it now how did the automatic calculation of grade happens now let's come here first of all scholastic grade create we have already created a b c d e f but if you want to create another e f g click add and the g is created now how does this work let's create for marks 50 now 50 is the maximum marks and from grade A is from 50 to 45 and it means pass now add neuro grade B is from 44 to 40 and it means pass again add neuro grade C is from 39 to for simplicity let's say 0 or, or, or let's say 10 and it means pass and one more row D means fail and from 9 to 0 so you see the range end range start is automatically calculated as as soon as you enter the uh, add new row button now just press save and you will see that 50 would appear here now because we have calculated this the 50 is appeared here if you want to edit it just click on edit 
and it will come here let's edit for 100 right now which has already been created so we can see this now it's currently 89 to 0 let me make it to 70 is B let's add new row C is from 69 to 50 and it also means pass and then add new row so 49 to let's say 33 is again pass and then the last is E which is 0 and it means fail now let's save it now once you save it let's go again result entry scholastic and let's re-enter data for the rest of the students order by name next now first 11 let's make let's fail him so you see 30 marks grade E fail um, 67 marks grade C pass so as soon as you enter automatically it will happen so this is how you set up you enter the marks let's save it that's it thank you